Hi, I'm Greg Brown. I'm David Ivey, and this is Dynamic Discussions. This is another installment in a weekly video series we're bringing you about safety products and how to use them. This week's question is, what is the lifespan of my personal fall arrest equipment? So when you're looking at the lifespan of your personal fall arrest equipment, the first thing we need to look at is the manufacturer's instructions. So you want to refer to those. Um, depending on the equipment you have, there may be a lifespan statement in them. Um, some may be five years, some may be a year. Kind of depends on the manufacturer and the equipment you're using. Yeah, so it's per manufacturer is the specifics that you really want to look for. You also want to make sure that you're looking at an expiration date instead of a manufacturing date, which you may see, hey, this is in the past and it could be expired, but just look uh, very closely at that. If you're using Malta Dynamics products, our self-retracting lifelines and our safety harnesses do not have an expiration date so long as they pass a competent person inspection as designated by OSHA. So you can have a harness for one year, two year, even 10 to 12 years, as long as you keep it stored nicely and it passes inspection, it should arrest a fall exactly like a brand new one. If you're looking at one of the manufacturer's suggested lifespan statements, so if they say it's good for five years, if you're working in harsh environments, it's likely it's not going to last that five years. So you need to make sure you're doing your, your pre-use inspections and your competent person inspections more regularly in those harsh conditions to make sure it does pass. Yes, and so just because it could be good for up to five years doesn't mean that you can, you can run it if it doesn't pass inspection. If you're wondering if your harness passes inspection or not, you can go to our website and download a free form that works for all fall protection harnesses.